Merry Christmas, one and all! Wait. Why are you wearing shades? It's Christmas time. Wait, so you guys are telling me that Christmas was two weeks ago? Hi everyone, welcome back to Bulba Beach. Now I've been away for a little bit of time. I took a bit of a content creation break that includes Twitch and Twitter and this, everything. Um, but I just wanna wish you guys a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Obviously I know I didn't post during that time so I do feel really bad. So uh, yeah, I hope you guys had an amazing day, especially due to all the circumstances that are happening around the world right now. I wanna say a huge thank you for making 2020 uh, my first year on youtube uploading videos <laughs> i'm just super happy with all the support so i really 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 do appreciate you all we are gonna dive straight into a villager hunt my island is looking a little bit trashy because i'm not gonna lie i haven't looked onto animal crossing for like a month all right so on today's video we are doing our usual hunt for the first islander that is dun, 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 dun. yellow I think this outfit is freaking adorable, by the way. Can we just assess how cute this outfit is? We are actually searching for the first yellow islander that we see. I've missed saying those words. So we are going to be having the islander move in up in this corner. So it's a nice little spot of land. Please don't look at my island, it's disgraceful. This is the little spot of land that they'll be moving into. It's quite nice, quite open. Just like these flowers, pretty and yellow. We have got so much to look forward to. If you guys do enjoy the video, please do like and subscribe. Obviously, I know a lot of you guys do watch my videos that aren't actually subscribed, so please do if you do enjoy the content. I am planning on doing videos once per week from now on going into 2021. We're gonna take this YouTube stuff very, very seriously. I also, oh my gosh, have a TikTok, wow! I know you guys follow me on Twitch and all the other social medias that I do post down below, but I have just made a TikTok. So if you do wanna follow me on that, it is Molly ZX Games, and I will obviously post the link in the description. Without further ado, let's get on with the haunt. If I'm honest, there's not actually a many islanders that I like that are yellow, but I really don't want to get Hippo, or Hippox as I used to call him, because he's been on my island for a while, he was on it for a very, very long time, so I feel like he's he's had his stay, he doesn't need to come back to Bulba Beach anytime soon. Quite excited to see uh, who we get, because I don't really know who's, who's a good one to get in this category, honestly. So in island number one, and we have a not yellow islander. Um, okay. I don't know who you are, but you are elegant. I like your coat, sir. What is your name? Avery. Avery, welcome. Hello. How are you? Why am I saying welcome? I don't know. Welcome to the deserted island, I guess, Avery. I'll see you later. <laughs> Um, so the character that I actually had to uh, kick out was Biff, who was actually a starting character for me. It was very heartbreaking. I didn't want actually Biff to leave, but my idea or my plan is to maybe pick him up later when he's got his actual house because he had the starting house and I really wanted to get all the houses fully furnished and fully fitting their theme. Don't forget guys, do leave a comment on what theme or color or anything you would like to see next. I do have a couple of ideas for the next few, but obviously I do take your comments on board. And as always, you can get a chance of appearing in the video, which is very exciting. How was everybody's Christmas? What did everyone get up to? Did you all get something rather nice? Did anyone get anything Animal Crossing themed? I actually got an Animal Crossing lanyard for work, which is very pretty and I really, really like it, but most of the stuff that I got was obviously Bulbasaur themed. Oh, a few of you were asking me too how my Bulbasaur uh, forest is coming along, and if I'm honest, it's not looking great. I'm think of, thinking of integrating Halloween and Christmas in the forest as well, but I'm not sure. I was kind of thinking of making like a North Pole section of my island, but I don't know. I want a Halloween town, but I want Bulbasaurs in it, so maybe it's a Bulbasaur Halloween, I don't know. So we're on island number two. Could this be you? Let's go, it's snowing, snowing, snowing. I need a yellow islander. Snowing, snowing, snowing. You're not a yellow islander. Hello, you've got a cute little hat. Samson, hi Samson. Look at your big grinning teeth. You're rather dashing, aren't you? It's lovely to meet you, Samson, but you're not yellow. You're not yellow, sir. So I must say goodbye to you. Island number three. 
Will V be yellow? Let us see. You are not yellow. Your orange is close. I love your hat though. Where did you get your hat from? Oh my God, your tusks. Tucker. Wait, is Tucker orange or yellow? I can't even, wait. He kind of looks yellow. The, the orange yellow characters are really gonna throw me off, but Tucker is freaking adorable. And I need you in my life. So I'm quickly gonna check if he is yellow or orange because honestly, I don't know. I actually think he's yellow. Is this about to be the shortest Animal Crossing villager hunt in history? I'm Googling this right now as we speak. <laughs> he's ginger. He's a ginger elephant. So he's not yellow, he is orange. From over here, he looks orange, but when you go close to him, he looks super duper yellow. So unfortunately, he's actually classed as orange because he's a ginger elephant, which is adorable. And I'm so sad because I love his little tusks, but I gotta leave him behind. So on island number four, we want more yellow villagers. Let's go, let us go. You are, oh wait, are we gonna have the same debate again? No, you're orange. Oh my god, you're the same color. Yeah, no, Buzz is more orange. Buzz is orange. At end of story. Buzz is orange. Buzz is as orange as these orange plants. So I'm saying hello. Those are some big boy fishies. Island number five. Let's see if we can run into a yellow islander that's actually yellow this time. <laughs> and not debatably yellow. You aren't. You are a robot. You are a robot. Who is adorable? Oh my god, I really want you. Oh my god, I really want him. It really upsets me that I have to leave him behind. <laughs> I like the funky looking islanders, man. They're just, they just got personality about them, you know? Okay, so on island number six, wait, did I bring my ladders? I did, okay, that's fine. I need to drop the ladders because I always forget to drop the ladders. Do we have anyone interesting? You're not yellow, sir. You're an angry little hamster. Why are you so angry? What's going on? Humphrey, nice to meet you, sir. I like your little turquoise eyebrows. They really bring out your eyes. God, those eyes are piercing. Okay, so I dropped the ladders onto island number seven now. Has it stopped snowing? Why has it stopped snowing? Oh wait, it's because I think it's because I left the the airport, right? Is that why? I'm not sure. Anyway, let's see if we can find the next islander. You have got a little bit of yellow on you, Keaton, but you are not fully yellow. You're mostly blue. So I will have to say goodbye to you, even though you did the super duper swirl that we love on this channel. Okay, so an island number eight. Always the great island and it's green uh, you're not oh, we've run into a few frogs today oh my jesus christ jam beats that is some lipstick that makes a statement i appreciate that i mean i am one to you know wear lots of different lipstick colors as you've probably seen on my instagram but damn those lips stand out i'm just jealous i don't have those lips let's be honest okay so this is island number nine Let's see if we are gonna get, ooh, I'm gonna take that bottle though first. God damn, I get distracted easy. I'll take that, thank you. Right, anyway, back to the Islander, which is the most important part. And it's, oh, this is, um, uh, what's his name? Oh my God, Bruce? Bruce, yeah, Bruce is cool. I like Bruce. This is Island number 10, we're already in the double digits, which is kind of crazy. I feel like we've flown through this hunt so far. So we are looking for somebody yellow. I can't jump over that, Molly. It's too far away. And wait, Rex is yellow. Rex is yellow, right? Rex, animal, <laughs> I gotta check it. I've always gotta check it. Oh my God, I thought we found him. He's orange apparently. It's kind of hard to tell with the light in. I think like what doesn't help is my island looks really yellow, like, well, the island in general looks really yellow and orange. So looking at these characters, they're kind of hard to tell. But the source says that he's orange and brown. Therefore, I can't take him, which is really upsetting because I really thought he was yellow. This is island number 11. I don't know, I feel like, uh, I feel like that last one was super, like, worse than the first one. That's kind of... This yellow is so difficult. Hello, Pappy. Pappy is cute. You are adorable. 
I like your face. It's cute. However, you are definitely like yellow. Not even debatably yellow. You're just straight up not yellow. <laughs> what do you think, guys? Would you guys would have took Rex? I think a lot of you guys probably would have took Rex because to me he looks yellow. But sources say that he's orange and brown, so I guess I gotta go off from the sources and not from my eye, I guess. My voice is going a little bit. Did you hear that? Island number twelve. Let's see if we can find a yellow islander this time. And you're definitely not yellow, are you, Drago? Hmm. Drago is definitely green. Hi, Drago. How you doing with your big pink lips? Love it. Highlighter pink. Love that. Love that. I need to get some highlighter pink lipstick, I swear. On island number 13, I'm looking for someone. It's Bamboo Island. Let's see if we can run into a yellow villager here. And I'm... Wait. You're another debatable one. Alfonso. I, th this hunt is literally the hardest hunt that I think I've ever done. Because it's so hard to tell between the orange and the yellow. So I'm gonna check Alfonso. I'm pretty sure he's like a mustard yellow. He's a burnt amber orange. I'm, I'm taking him. He's a mustard yellow. And plus, I'm running out of Nook Mile tickets, honestly. So I feel like I need to take somebody before I run out. And I think he kind of ma matches my jumpsuit. So I'm going to say Alfonso is a mustard yellow. I'm actually going to put the pictures up of reference of the two colors. So what I think that he is, mustard yellow. And what the sources say is, which is an am burnt amber orange. Which to me doesn't make much sense. But we are inviting Alfonso to the island. Which means we've got two gators on the island. Because we've got Gale. Gale, the lovely pink gator. And now we have Alfonso joining the crew as well. So let's go back to the island and introduce him with open arms so we'll be right back okay you yellow alfonso definitely yellow and definitely not burnt amber orange how are you doing look at your house oh this house looks so pretty here actually are you in hello knock 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 welcome to the island mr alfonso i can't wait to come in oh wait there's gonna be boxes never mind but look at right this is this is yellow to me this is yellow, but look, it's so cute. It's so, it's interesting. It's definitely interesting decor. Alfonso, welcome. How are you? Say hello to YouTube. What do you guys think of Alfonso, guys? Do you like him? Is he one that you like? Is he one you don't like? I think he's pretty cool. I don't mind the alligators. You know, the alligators seem to be a little bit underrated in my opinion, and especially Gale, because Gale's like my one true love in terms of alligators, but here we are. All right, guys, so that was the Yellow Islander hunt. Again, it was quite a debatable one. And if I'm honest, it was probably the most difficult one that we've ever done. And I'm sorry if I picked an, what you thought was an orange islander. It's just really difficult to, to sort of sense what's yellow and what's orange between those. And again, I think the lighting doesn't help the situation. I do want to say sorry, just in case you guys think I've made the wrong decision. You can have a quick look at my my forest. It's just, uh, yeah, it does, doesn't look good. Please don't judge me. Bulbasaur forest isn't fully there. This bit's done. This bit looks nice. Yeah, wow, look at this bit. Should we see what we got in the jar, actually, from the, uh, from the island? Hello, what do we have? We have a rocking horse. I think I know that. Oh, no, I don't. Interesting. Okay, pretty cool. Um, yeah, I plan on getting some more orange and uh, black roses for this a little bit, but this, this section's done anyway, but yeah. It needs more work. Anyway, thank you so much, guys. Again, please do like and subscribe if you do enjoy the video. Make sure you do follow me on all social media, such as Twitch, Twitter, Instagram, and now TikTok. Woo! Again, I stream five days a week over on Twitch, so please do check that out. And tell me that you're from YouTube, because, again, I love to see you guys over there. And I want to say thank you so much for an amazing 2020, and happy 2021. And I will see you guys probably in a week or so with the next video which is going to be one that's been highly requested by you guys. So do look out for that. And that is me signing off from Bulba Beach. Goodbye for now. Don't forget, guys, you can use code MOLLY5 at checkout at fiercepc.co.uk to get 5% off a gaming PC. Link for that will be down below, as well as all my links. Thank you so much, guys. See you later.